Traction 7 is an incredible free audio recording program. But where's the mixer? Welcome back to another Traction 7 Basics video from Simple Green Tech. I'm Radio Zane, and in today's video, we're going to look at the mixer in Traction 7. You might be saying, wait, Traction 7 has a mixer? But I can't find it. Well, it's hiding in plain sight, right on the main page. You might be used to seeing mixers lined up along the bottom of the screen in other programs, or maybe they even have a screen dedicated to the mixer. Traction 7 puts all of the controls right over here. On the right side of each track is your mixer section. It may look slightly different from traditional mixer views, but it offers the same features. This is your gain control here. You just click and drag. This is your left-right pan control. Click and drag again. Here you have your level meter. And if we had some audio in there and we were playing it, you would see the levels go up and down. And then over here you have your mute and your solo buttons. You can also easily add effects to your track by right-clicking anywhere in this mixer section here, add new plugin, and you'll see your Traction plugins. These are the ones that came with Traction. So we'll add, let's see, a chorus. And you can see it's right here. You can add as many plugins as you like. Your computer power is pretty much the only limit you have here. And we'll add a reverb. And if you want, you can change the order that these effects go in just by clicking and dragging to either side. Now you'll notice with traction effects, the effects that come with traction, that their interface is down here. This is where you control each setting of whatever effect it is you're using, or you can load a preset up. If you're new to the world of VST plugins and you're not too sure on how to install them and get traction to notice them, I've done another video on that and I'll link to it in the description so you can get started with installing plugins, where to find plugins, and how to get traction to see the plugins that you have installed. Now that's it for our Traction 7 Mixer Overview. It's very straightforward and easy to access. Now I have a question for you. Have you started using Traction yet? If so, how do you enjoy the workflow? Let me know what you like or dislike about Traction in the comments below. Thank you for sticking around and watching this video. If you'd like to show your support, Please subscribe to the channel. You'll also get to see more videos from us that way. And if you'd like to give a big thank you, you can head over to our Patreon page and become a member for just $1. For Simple Green Tech, I'm Radio Zane, and we'll talk soon.